that shopping for ages. And I've bought everything. I've bought everything. I've bought I bought things for girls. I don't even, there's no girl who deserves it, but they're just beautiful items. Shoes and diamond APs and handbags. I bought myself loads of stuff and there's nothing to buy. I've spent a million dollars on mine, I bought. Yesterday I bought a 1972 gold Cartier vintage cigarette lighter. We're just buying stuff because we're stuck on house arrest. And you know the worst thing? We can't spend more money than we make from our house. Hmm. It's got a conundrum. What was our biggest impulse purchase ever? Impulse? In terms of like, see it, buy it. Yeah. Rolls Royce. Was mm-hmm. it the Rolls Royce? That was our biggest. We walked past the window and we were signing papers 10 minutes later. That was $500,000. That, our, our, that was our biggest impulse. Everything else we at least thought about it, thought I want this, should we buy it. Rolls Royce, we were, we were walking down the street on our way to get coffee. The world's best coffee. Is it really the best? I'm super excited. It's wonderful. It just might be the world's best coffee. Car, schmar. Car, schmar. schmar. Audi's Audi. Although they are super expensive. We have every other car. What else are we gonna fucking buy? We have every other... Oh, All right. No, what? Oh, no, you can't just buy rolls. Not a problem. Not a problem, my friend. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you very much. And I hope one day we have Cheers. another drink in Bucharest. We're waiting for you. We're waiting for you. We sent an impulse text message. A, B, or C? A. A. A for Aston. Fine. Luca Aston Martin. What was B and C? Good question. <laughs> so you're thinking of buying that Aston Martin under the new one? I guess we should. We'll see. I don't think we'll end up buying another car. We really don't need another car. Good boy. Hi. Hello, how are you? I'm fine, and you? Wonderful, as always. Yeah, just fine. Perfect. Uh, so yeah, thank you very much for your time. Thank you very, very much for your inquiry about uh, the three cars. I think at the moment we are at three: Manala, DB12, and DBS Superliga. Ready? Sure. I shared the, my display with you. Born ready. We are starting with the DB12. Yeah, so I've, I've, I've watched a little bit about this online. Uh, obviously, it's not as fast as the DBS, though, is it? It's quite similar, yeah, but uh, also Vanquish is in it, V12 Vantage. So I think we have a, a car which is made out of uh, the best ones from Aston Martin right now. It, it's V8, right? It's a V8, yeah. Six. All right, then we are finished. I'll show you a video again. I had to find some time to drive all these cars. Yeah. Just buy them and they just sit stationary. Body guards are going to have to move it for me. Because what happens if you step out? They put me back in jail. The steering is hard. Oh, okay. The two knees back. Tristan, what supplements do you take? You're built like a tank, I know. But there's one affordable tip I have for everybody at home for staying in great shape. That's plenty of vitamin C. By vitamin C, of course, I'm talking about caviar. Now, caviar fits about anybody's budget. A tin like this should cost you no more than $1,000. 
five or six spoonfuls of this per day. It's my secret for unlimited power. Tristan was right. Garlic baked rolls and caviar. So when you're from the street, you got the garlic baked rolls. Then you get rich and buy loads of caviar all the time because it costs lots of money. You eat it while you have a massage in your mansion while on house arrest for crimes you didn't commit because you've conquered the world. So it's a good combo. I mean, it's God's plan. Took me from the bake roll life to the caviar life. Gave me a mansion. They made me super famous and influential. They made the Matrix attack me so I can win. I'm a fan. I get sent presents quite often, to be honest. Probably once a day I get a present. It's nice, you know? It's good to know that my sacrifices, sacrificing my life to combat the Matrix, is appreciated. So, uh, let's see what's in today's package, shall we? You have a knife at arm's length throughout the whole house. <laughs> I do, don't I? You're right. That's exactly what I have. This one's a bit big. This one's a bit big, though. I should have another one somewhere. A little bit more manageable. Choices. What kind of man does not have weapons within arm's length on every chair he possibly sits on? Think about it. Every chair you sit on in your house, you should have a weapon within arm's length. Everyone should know this is unscripted. I've never seen those knives before in my life. But it's true. It's true. Think of your, your chair you're on most often in your house. How long would it take you to get a weapon? What, what go downstairs? What's wrong with you people? People think I'm crazy. I think everyone else is crazy. Why wouldn't I have knives everywhere? Andrew, read me when you have some time. Should we read this first? Let's read this. Let's see. Hi, Andrew. Tristan, thank you for working my clothes into one of your videos. Didn't know I did that. On Twitter, so this is clothes. Life changing, from life changing, but I don't read it it's quite personal. Much love and respect. Plus. All right, so some clothes. Supposedly they've been worked into a video, so maybe he's taken something before this guy. He's prepared them for the Romanian Postal Service, which is a good thing. You know what? The number of times, maybe about five or six times, I've ordered designer clothes, and it get, they, they steal the clothes at the box, and the box comes in. Really? In Romania, yeah. Fuckers. Oh, yeah, I know. Here we go. Should I help him out? Should I model it? I look beautiful. Sure. 